Hi, this is a quick explanation of how to read through a chart. Um, you would think, like when you're reading a book, that you start at the beginning and play one thing after the other until you get to the end, and that's the end of that. But with music charts, um, there are various road signs that we have that allow us to go backwards and forwards a little bit, to repeat some bits and to jump ahead or jump back in the chart. Uh, it just saves us having to write out everything a hundred times. Um, so there are a few elements we want to look at here. First, we have the double bar line with two dots. This is called the repeat bar line. Two lines and two dots here, and two lines and two dots there. And those uh, are the beginning and ending of a repeat section. And anything you see within those two double bar lines uh, is repeated, right? So we would play this section from here, following the verse through the chorus, you get to this double bar line here, and then you go back to the beginning of that section and you do it again. You play that whole section twice, verse, chorus, verse, chorus, okay? When you've done with that, you then continue on and play the guitar solo. When you get to the end of the guitar solo, you can see it says DS al coda here. DS means go back to the sign and keep playing until you see the words to coda. So we get to the guitar solo, DS al coda, we jump back up to the beginning of the verse and we play all the way here until we see the words to coda. When we see to coda, we jump down to this circle with a cross through it, which is the coda. And so we skip the chorus and the guitar solo in the middle here, we jump to here, and then we finish off the song, okay? So just to recap, the way we play this is we start off with the intro, we play through, we play through the verse, we play through to the end, we play the chorus, we keep going, and when we hit this double bar line, we bounce back and play the verse and the chorus again. At this stage, you're not paying attention to the words to coda. You're just keeping playing. When you've played this whole section twice, you continue on through the guitar solo. And when you get to the end of the guitar solo, you've got DSL coda, which tells us to go back and start the verse again. And you keep playing from the sign, the S, until you get to the words to coda, and then you skip all of this, the chorus and the guitar solo, and you go straight down to the coda and play the last little bit of the song. And that's how you navigate through it.